Welcome back, folks, to Let's Play Yu-Gi-Oh! The Eternal Duelist Soul for the Game Boy Advance. I'm Samurai TX, and the last time we left off we be Rare Hunter, Roombra and Loomis, and the dumbest duelist in this game, Arcana. I don't need to stress how stupid that guy really is. I think the past two duels with him has shown that this guy is such a crappy magician. I got more tricks up my sleeve than that idiot. Right, let's duel shrinks. Alright, we get what you say. Draw. Win. I'm gonna pick second place. Let's duel! Alright, let's see what he's gonna do. Okay, well at least his strategy is much smarter than Arcana's already. See how much got. He's got five cards, so we're gonna give him a thousand life points damage. There we go. Nice play numerous healer. That's probably gonna make him restore. What a waste of what a waste of, of a card. Let's play that. And then we're going to summon Celtic Guardian in attack mode. And we're gonna equip Malevolent Nuzla with the Celtic Guardian to give it a twenty-one um, 700 attack points boost, so it can have 2100 attack. Battle phase right away, and we are going to attack his face down monster. Ah, Bistro Butcher. Celtic Guardian would have destroyed it with um, no more attack points, to be honest. Right. Monster Reborn. He's brought back Bistro Butcher. Okay. And then he's played. Okay, smart. Okay, I'm gonna play this card face down. Then, I'm going to switch my Celtic Guardian to Defense Mode. I'm going to risk it, see if it's Mirror Force, that's why I'm doing that. Then to Battle Phase. Then, I'm going to attack his Bistro Butcher. I won uh, Mirror Force. Okay. We're going to complete our turn. Celtic Guardian is in trouble, though. Of course. Oh, wait. They're attacking my Ryukishi powered. Okay. Wait, um, yes, we're gonna activate. We're gonna play the gate attack. I was thinking momentarily, but yeah. Ooh, seven tools of the bandit. Okay. Okay, looks like our um, monster's gone. My move. Okay. They're gonna switch Celtic Guardian back to attack mode because we don't want to lose him. And then we're going to attack Dark Elf, make um, him lose 100 life points. Right. I end my turn. Celtic Guardian's really um, standing out well, so yeah, that's pretty nice. Harpy's Feather Duster. Resolve it as a chain and play Magic Gemma. Discard Gyakuten of Agami. Destroy his um, Harpy's Feather Duster so I can keep my um, Melvin Nuzzler. Play Crawling Dragon in attack mode. I'm going to attack with both my monsters. Yeah, Celtic Guardian's really doing well. Only because I gave it an. Oh god, Celtic Guardian's back in my hands. Melvin Nuzzler is um, back in. is going in the graveyard, which is pretty disappointing. Penguin Knight. Okay, hopefully I can summon um, Steel Open Grotto. I hope I can. Right. I play this card face down. Then I summon Celtic Guardian in attack mode again. Just to protect myself, um, I do have trap holes, so if they try to destroy my monsters, I'm going to, um, you know, sack. Uh oh. Oh, that's not too bad. I got a new hat. Oh, that's not too bad. Celtic Guardian can attack directly. Okay. I will definitely bring back... I'll definitely bring Dark Magician now, but... Let's proceed to main phase 2, sorry. And we're going to... Play that card face down. That card face down. And that card face down. And then my turn. So we played three cards face down, so that's pretty nice. Bistro Butcher. Um... Yes, we are going to play Wobaku, so that we don't lose any uh, monsters or life points. Good. 
Nope. Don't need to. He's played a card face down, okay. What I'm going to do is play Call of the Haunted. Bring back Steel Ogre Grotto. Nope. Never gonna play Change of Heart. Unless he's got Magic Jabber somewhere. Which he probably doesn't. Yes, he does! Okay, fair play. But are we gonna activate something else? Yes, we're gonna activate Seven Tools of the Bandit! I know we're gonna lose a thousand life points for it, but that's it's gonna be well worth it because then we can use Change of Hearts. Then we are going to sacrifice um, his monster and Celtic Guardian to summon the Dark Magician in attack mode. It's a battle phase. Attack with Steel Ogre Grotto. Then attack with Crawling Dragon. And then we are going to end this duel with Dark Magic Attack. And this duel is over. Number win. Wow, this let's play has been going very good actually. Yes, I know I won. Thank you very much for telling the state of the obvious. Kairiushin. Kairiushin. Dragon Seeker. Oh, that's pretty good. Water Magician, Penguin Soldier. That's another good card. So yeah, we're going to put Penguin Soldier in our deck. We're going to put Penguin Soldier in our deck because Penguin Soldier can bring back two of his people's cards back in their hand. So yeah, we can definitely use Penguin Soldier. To main deck, please. That's it. And then we're going to duel Marik Ishtar. You still haven't had enough? Fine, I don't mind being your partner for the time being. I had nothing better to do anyway. Well, I've come to duel because I've got to beat you four times, so all I've ever do is duel for the second time. Merrick's theme's pretty damn cool in this game. Right. Play that card in defense mode. And what's this magic card? Giant Trunade. Not too bothered. Should play Trap Master really, but I'll play Trap Master next turn. Magic card change of heart. Oh great. <laughs> that's bitch. That's that's oh god. Oh god. Right, he's already dealing some good damage on me. He's got rid of my summon skull, okay. Oh, so that's what Giant Hat does. Wow, Mag really took it to me there. Ouch. That hurts very badly, but I'm not going to dwell on it too much. Let's play this card in defense mode, and end my turn. I'm only going um, to keep a trap master there because of the fact that trap master can destroy a trap guard. Okay, I don't mind, you can destroy my trap master. Right. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Damn it, Mystical Space Typhoon. Okay, I know that's, that's... Wow, he's got three cards face down now. Um, we're gonna play Neo the... We're gonna play Neo the Magic Swordman in attack mode. Trap hole, okay. Fair play. Gonna end my turn. Wow. Marek's really brought it to the table. Okay. One of them are... One of them, one of them cards is definitely um, uh, what you call it. One of them cards is definitely uh, mirror force. I bet you. We're gonna attack his magical hats. Oh, none of them are mirror force. Okay, let's complete our turn. Oh god! Should have seen that coming. I don't mind. As long as Marek plays his trump cards here and there. Monster Reborn. I've got some of the. I think he discarded my summon skull actually. That is pretty nice, but I know he's got something up his sleeve, so I'm gonna play Giant True Nade. Keep your cards up there. Play Monster Reborn. Bring back my summon skull. Good thing Monster Reborn came. Now I can actually beat the crap out of you. 
I'm going to equip Sword of Dark Destruction to give it um, a 400 attack points boost. Then I'm going to attack your weaker monster so you can lose more life points. I think that's more of a smarter strategy because I'm pretty much losing here. Complete my turn. I could have just summoned another monster, but I'm not going to. Mystical Space Typhoon. Okay, fair enough. There we go. Then he's going to play. He's probably going to play two cards face down there. Oh, no, he's not. Okay. I'm going to play Black Loom Fire Dragon. And I'm going to get rid of your most powerful monster so far, which is Millennium Golem. Bye! Then I'm going to use Black Loom Fire Dragon to attack this monster. Okay, Bistro Butcher, then go. Likely his face down monster is a manny, a bug, or even a stronger uh, attacking monster. Told you, it's gem my elf, but yeah. I saw that coming. He's taken the risk to attack me there. Knowing that I still have knowing that I have summoned skull. He's not gonna place his face down monsters. Don't face down cards again. Okay. It's fine. Attack you. Make you do 600 life points. There you go. Then I'm going to complete my turn. Please don't let there be a man eating bug somewhere. For Christ's sake, he's gonna kill my summon skull. Oh my god. Then he's gonna place two face down cards. I knew that was gonna happen, but I'm gonna play Heavy Storm. No, I'm not gonna activate a chain. Goodbye, and goodbye. What's those two trap cards? Magic Jammers? Okay, they weren't really too much of a threat. Right, I'm going to play Celtic Guardian. And I'm going to attack his man eater bug for just for the treacherous for the treacherous act it just did and eliminate my summon skull. So I'm going to eliminate your bug, because it got on my nerves. Now I'm leading by 50 life points. Oh great. He's going to get rid of Mystical Space Type and I'm going to have to get rid of Dark Magician. Oh, cheers, Merrick, you douchebag. Unless I get called of the Hornet, I can't call back Dark Magician. I can't call on Dark Magician. But I can call on Swordstalker. And I got Giant Soldier Stone there, so... Part of the cards has um, helped me here at this very moment in time. You're going to lose 100 life points. And I'm still going to have a monster on the field. Swordstalker's a very strong monster, so I'm glad that I got Swordstalker when I did. <laughs> Right, your move, Marrick. None of us have cards. I right, he's played a defensive monster. And I draw, and I'm going to play Le Jin, the mystical genie of the lamp. And I'm going to attack your face down monster with Le Jin. Please don't let me man eat a bug. Oh my goodness gracious me. Oh. I knew he had a man eat a bug. He just had to get the man eat a bug. And I'm frustrated for that because I knew that was coming. Attack with Lajin. Make him on um, 750 life points. Proceed to main phase 2 actually. I'm going to sacrifice um, a monster. Sacrifice my Lajin for losing his faceless mage. Let's see if he can take the bait. He probably won't because he knows I sacrificed. Oh, he can't even attack. Okay. I'm just going to beat you with Illusionless Faceless Mage then. And win the duel. But he was so frustrating. But I had to win the hard way. At least I got a better duel out of Merrick than I did in my last four duels. Have you managed to reinforce your deck? Did you know that you can now select a new booster pack? Select it when you've got a chance. Where? Oh, this one. That looks like Relinquish. Let's see what's in it. Giggle. Griggle. Um, the Reliable Guardian. What's that? Increase one defense monsters when this card is activated. Okay. Chain Energy. As long as this card remains face up on the field, both you and your monsters think play. Okay. Mystical Space Typhoon. Okay. Darkness Approaches. This card, two cards from your hand, select one face up monster and flip it face down. But do not change his battle position. Okay. Today is the delivery day for the copy of Weekly Yu-Gi-Oh! You open the pages of the magazine to see what five cards you contain this week. 
Silver bow and arrow, I keep getting that. Steel shell. Oh, the card's crap. My, my last uh, pack that I opened was better than this. Doesn't matter. Either way, um, when we come back, folks, we will play more Yu-Gi-Oh! The Eternal Duelist Soul. Until then, until then, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.